Welcome to another instructional snippet. In this instructional video, we will be applying the first and second laws of thermodynamics to determine the final temperature and change of entropy for an irreversible process. Here is the problem statement. Our system consists of two blocks of the same metal, differing only in their initial temperature. Blocks remain well insulated from the surroundings throughout the process. The blocks are brought into thermal contact for each block find the final temperature and the change in entropy. Bringing the two blocks together does not involve an exchange of work or thermal energy with the surroundings. The change in internal energy is then equal to zero. Using the fact that the change in internal energy of the closed system is zero allows us to solve for the final temperature denoted as T2. The details are provided here. Now let's move on to finding the change in entropy for each block. For a solid, the equation to solve for a change in entropy due to a change in temperature is provided. This equation is used for each block along with the initial and already determined final temperatures. The results are provided. Before we wrap up, let's look at the total change in entropy. Summing up the changes for block A and B, we obtain 65 joules per Kelvin. A positive change in entropy indicates two things. The process is possible and it is irreversible. I hope you found this instructional snippet useful. If so, then please like and subscribe. Thanks and have a great day.